Hello, welcome to this video about the DJI Mavic Air and its single biggest problem. Here's how to fix it. Personally, I've found the biggest issue with the DJI Mavic Air I've been finding is that it's been disconnecting at about 5 to 10 metres. Now, that's been pretty disappointing, obviously. And the issue actually isn't with the Mavic Air or the controller. The issue is with this. Now, this is the cable that runs from your phone and the controller. Sending information back and forth really fast, and um, it's going through this little micro USB port on the side. Biggest issue here is A, you're going to end up breaking the micro USB, micro USB port, but also this connection isn't great. Uh, the cable they provide is terrible, it's cheap, uh, which is pretty disappointing for a £700 drone, but uh, it is, and so the connection is really unstable. So, actually, when you look at your drone, if it does disconnect, what you're going to find is that the little LED light on the controller, which is just here, that will actually still remain green, but it will say aircraft disconnected up the top here, and it will all be red. Okay, so if that's green and it says aircraft disconnected, then this is going to solve your problem. It's as simple as this. Okay, unplug your micro USB cord from your phone, literally chuck it away. Completely useless. Get yourself one of these. This is a uh, USB A to, in my case, USB C, but you can get it for iPhones, every type of camera. And you're going to want to plug it into the bottom of the controller just here, like so. And then what I do is I loop it around like this, and then in the top. And what we'll do is we'll just see how it's going, and you'll see here, you'll see here. There's literally no issues at all. It's going to be working fine. Now I've been using the uh, new cable for about a week now and I've had absolutely no issues at all. Before I was getting disconnects at about every minute, every two minute. Now I haven't had a single issue. So it solved the single biggest problem the Mavic Air was causing for me. Uh, literally just by swapping out the cable and coming out of the USB-A. This one in particular is really good. It's a really fast cable which seems to work pretty well because uh, I did try the ones that came with my phone, no luck. So yeah, pick up this cable certainly, it's about £6 and it's going to solve you all your issues and it could save losing your £700 drone. So pick one up and also you'll find the video flows a lot better on here than it does normally uh, using the micro USB for some reason and you're not going to be breaking your port so you can keep it for charging. The only other little extra I was going to add was you can pick up one of these, I'm not sure how well the camera will pick that up. Uh, it's a little micro USB uh, magnetic thing that you can put into the end here. Uh, just put it into a micro USB cord. And it then means that you're just going to be able to plug in your um, charging thing in here so it's not going to start damaging the port because you'll only put it in once and you take it out once and the USB-A port is much better. Uh, and this one's also a super speed USB 3. So it just works perfectly. So that is how to solve single-handedly the biggest issue with the DJI Mavic Air and get four, five kilometer range, no issues at all. So thanks very much for watching. Hope that's helpful and check the links in the description.